NBC 15 News starts now. Hello and thank you for joining NBC 15 News on the Web. I'm Christine Belport. Here are the stories we're following for you today. Former child star Dustin Diamond is now a free man. The former Saved by the Bell actor, best known for his role as Screech, was released from a Wisconsin prison yesterday. He served just under three months of a four-month sentence for disorderly conduct and carrying a concealed weapon. Diamond earned early release by cleaning jail floors and doing laundry. The actor was convicted in connection with the 2014 incident where he stabbed a man during a fight inside a Port Washington bar. The three state unions challenging the right to work law are expected to submit a proposed final order to a judge today. Right to work laws require unions represent workers who do not pay dues. The lawsuit claims right to work is an illegal grab of union services. A Dane County judge agreed and struck down the law Friday. Governor Walker says the state law will be the state will be aggressive to get the right work right to work law reinstated. The attorney general is going to be aggressive in that regard. Uh, Brad Schimmel has made it very clear he's going to advocate aggressively. We're confident uh, the law will ultimately be upheld. We've gone through this before with Act 10. Attorney General Brad Schimmel says the Department of Justice wants the law to remain in place while the appeal is pending. He may go to the state Supreme Court to take the case, and conservative-leaning justices control the high court, increasing the likelihood the law would be upheld. And finally, Appleton's Miller Electric says it has laid off 76 workers. The welding and manufacturing company laid off office and plant employees. The reduction, they say, was announced yesterday as a result of lower demand for products. That's all we have for you. Go out and make it a great day.